When we talk about agility, we can imagine a person elegantly navigating their body through difficult spaces. The same goes for emotionally agile people. They are able to navigate psychologically through difficult times. And the one technique they use is the observer. The observer means taking a step back and observing or witnessing your emotional states without judgment, without reacting to them. So I'd like to share with you three important points in terms of you becoming the observer. The first thing is that our emotions are not who we are. As the observer, we take a step back and give ourselves the psychological space to notice these emotional states and realize that they come and go. They arise and fade like a river flowing through us. And as we observe it from this perspective, we don't become these emotions. Secondly, the observer doesn't judge. When we judge, we create resistance, and this resistance intensifies our emotional states. The observer instead is curious and compassionate about what we are feeling. And through this, we get a much better understanding of ourselves. Lastly, the observer helps cultivate mindfulness. Mindfulness is where we are present to these emotional states, even the most painful ones, and we do not get caught up in them. And ultimately, this mindfulness helps us respond intentionally to these emotional states instead of impulsively. Now, I will be sharing shortly with you some techniques in terms of how you can work with the observer. So until then, take care and stay aware.